Hello people, back again. Now when you come to the clone of hardware scene, which is a big scene these days, obviously the Retron 5, obviously which emulates several systems, uh, you know, you get, you got, you know, the analog and T and other systems like that these days. It was just a matter of time before the ZX Spectrum got its own clone. And in this case, it is called the ZX Uno. Now, uh, this is basically a fan-made clone of the Spectrum. Uh, based, although uh, this system is yet to be released, uh, on the site they're, they're quite promising quite a few things for this system. Uh, first of all, the FPGA based uh, board, uh, it behaves just like a ZX Spectrum, but also has other features that were not in the original Spectrum. For example, it comes equipped with the SD card slot. So basically, uh, you can load dot tap files directly into it uh, to play any of your favorite games or maybe games you don't even own that you'd like to try. Uh, not only that, but this is designed to fit inside a Raspberry Pi case for those who love Raspberry Pi. And it also offers an audio in for 3.5 millimeter jack port. So uh, for those who want to uh, boot up to the original cassette. Again, one of the things you gotta do, and I think you've seen this retro and other things, if you're gonna make a system, something of a retro system, a lot of those gamers want to get all the retro out of it. And what I mean is, why the Retro 5, whether you like the compatibility issues that they're, obviously they're not, it doesn't emulate everything properly and, and everything like that. For a lot of old time gamers, the reason why they weren't into it was simply because they couldn't hook it up to their old TV. That it was a minor or underside of the Retron 5 was that while it's cool you can hook up to HDMI TV, there was no actual port to hook it up to regular, regular old school TV to play on a CRT. So being the ability to allow it to boot up original cassettes is a big thing because there are, again, this thing is made to appeal to the Z, ZX Spectrum fans and if the ZX Spectrum fans want this, they may want it to do the original stuff. And I think this is one of the things a lot of these companies have to go, do going forward with these clones is if I'm a hardcore fan of that system I want to have that original experience that I had on that system before or have the ability that if I want to do the original experience I can get that without having to sacrifice. Now one of the most amazing things about the ZX Uno is basically the estimated cost. They're estimating the cost to buy this thing is a mere 30 euros which equals $40.94 currently in US dollars. So the price for this thing is very affordable, very cheap for people to buy. And that's one of the biggest things. It's affordable for anybody to sit there and go, you know what? I'm going to pick that up on a whim. Maybe you never had a ZX Spectrum before and you want to, you want to, you know, play those games and this will allow you to do that. So again, they haven't announced a release date or anything like that. Uh, somewhere in the video, I'm sure you've already seen a picture of what this thing looks like. Again, it's really small. It's really compact. And, uh, it plays for the ZX Spectrum fans. It gives them, you know, a clone system. Maybe they want to buy it at an affordable price. So, what do you think of the ZX Uno made by a fan? With the price point of the system, would you be like, you know, what I've always wanted to play Spectrum games, but I never, never thought of, you know, didn't want to spend the money, and now you might do it. I mean, let's be honest. Like over here in the states, the Spectrum wasn't something that came out over here. You just, you, you never saw it. You didn't know it existed. Never playing the games. So, for a lot of people over here, like myself. It would be kind of cool to play the games. And at a, a affordable price to make you at least think about, less than a full price video game. Anyway, what do you think about the ZX Uno? Love to hear your thoughts about everything, because from the price to the what the system does, I'd love to hear your thoughts. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.